Although the X904 was designed to operate in an offshore environment, it will perform better and last longer if it is rinsed thoroughly with fresh water, allowed to dry, and then covered or stored in a shaded area. On a regular basis, the pole should be rotated to prevent fusing. Insert the tightening boards in the handles of the coupling and rotate the pole three turns in a clockwise direction. Then rotate the pole back counterclockwise to tighten. The stainless steel snap shackles on the man positioning lanyards should be sprayed regularly with an anti-corrosion lubricant. If the basket will be assembled on an as-needed basis only, then it should be disassembled immediately after use. This will help prevent the top and bottom of the pole couplings from fusing. Periodically, swab the threaded end and the bottom end with a lubricant that will not adversely react with aluminum. The sling, part 904-10, should be replaced in accordance with sling replacement regulations in your geographical area. All load-bearing parts of the X904 should be inspected regularly. If there is any excessive wear, the unit should be removed from service until it can be repaired or replaced. The X904 should be inspected before each use. Every six months, a competent person, according to relevant API specifications, should conduct a thorough inspection of the unit. Every two years, the X904 should be refurbished, with parts replaced as required. Areas which should be subjected to careful inspection are load-bearing lines, hardware, covers, and flotation. The aluminum center post should be evaluated for structural integrity. The logistics of this semi-annual safety inspection will vary among different operators, so contact the Billy Pugh Company for detailed instructions. With proper care, inspection, and use, it is estimated that the life of the unit is about four years. It can be rebuilt and recertified. Again, contact the Billy Pugh Company for details.